Hey, what's up, everybody? Rich from Street Gear, Hempstead, New York. Today we're going to re review three shoes. All three are quick strikes. You have two Air Trainer 2s, original colors, and you got an um, Air Force Premium um, that's also quick strike. These, these Air Trainer 2s were released September 2nd uh, for $110. These come out today, September 7th at $135, the Premium. We're first going to do these original colorway Air Trainer 2s. This shoe, come out, this shoe came out originally in 1990. Uh, it's a second generation Bo Jackson. The first one was, was 1989, Air Trainer 1s. Uh, this is when Nike, uh, well, well, when the category of cross training was very big. It was as big as probably as, as basketball back then. Um, a lot of shoes were in, in the, in the, made from that cross training silhouette. But uh, these, are, these are the Bo Jackson cross trainers. They were very popular. Um, and these are two original colorways. Now, this also, it's a great original because it's made out of the exact material that was used back in 1990. I don't know if it picks up on the uh, on the camera, but this is like a real heavy duty leather. Just how, how the shoe is structurally made is a lot more sounder than I'm gonna show you one that came out a couple weeks ago. I don't know if it's gonna be picked up on the camera, but um, if you can see the difference from this leather material to compared to this, this has got a lot, much more beefier look to it. Um, just looks nicer, look, much more beefier, much more richer look. Um, but I think that was pretty cool, but bringing out the original material used. These two colorways were also pretty, um, you know, uh, they were popular back in, in the days. These are the Citron, the Reds, um, and the Teal colors. These, these silhouettes were pretty common. In, in shoes, you've got the first one, which was white, cement gray, um, neutral gray, and Citron. This also shoe, um, comes has a teal um, upper collar and on the tongue, which doesn't say on the box. I don't know if I originally said that um, when the original com original one came out. There's also a little bit of that teal on the back heel. Colorway. Let's give you the bottom look too real fast. This one's playing out the uh, infrared. This one does the citron, citrus on the bottom. And there they are. They're two good looking shoes. Um, like I said, this is probably the first really OG one that came out that is true to as far as the material that was used when they came out. The quick strikes, and not that many stores got these shoes. Um, we don't have any pair of them. And I think right now, I think we start um, in an eight and a half and above in the sizes. And I'll show you a couple of hats that'll match these up in a minute. Put these back up here. Now we'll go to the, the Brazilian Air Force, the E. Pazavel, which means it is possible. This is uh, this is an Air Force Premium. It's a quick strike. Um, the color, well, they're just saying black, black on the box. But these are the colors of the Brazilian flag that are on it. These are releasing today, which is September 7th, which is the Brazilian National Day. It's like their Independence Day um, today, September 7th. So it releases uh, here today. It released before, I think, in Brazil. I forgot what date it was, but they had a couple days earlier release. There's a couple stores in my, um, in I think Miami that have the shoe, and there's some stores up here in New York, um, but there's not that many stores that are getting the shoe. It's a, it's a global release shoe because it's going in two different countries, but I think most of them are um, both between us and, and, and Brazil that are getting them. This shoe, Nike keeps its, you know, its pulse on different things that are happening around the world. They love to attach the Air Force One, which is their, you know, staple shoe. This is the shoe that was named after, you know, the, the president's uh, plane. Um, came out in 1982. Um, it's it's a pretty staple in Nike's uh, um, inventory as far as what they show with shoes. It came out, I think, over 1,800 different uh, styles. The shoe has been made in, but this shoe, like I said, it's for it's for recognizing uh, the Brazil National Day. It's recognizing this, this cultural uh, movement that's happening um, in Brazil between basketball, um, artistry, and, and hip hop. That whole that whole cultural side they're 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 really trying to uh, touch to. There's even also a movie being made. Uh, it's a short movie. Yeah. The guy's name is Victor Navas. He's making a short story. I, I just looked it up today. It's on. You can do it on YouTube if you just type in um, that E. Pazavel Nike. Um, Air Force One. It actually showed up on the bottom, but there's a little short, like two-minute film, um, showing uh, a couple guys wearing the shoe and just about a little bit more about the movement, what it's about. It's in Portuguese, so you're not going to understand it, but you can get a, you know, just by watching it and looking at what's being filmed, you can, you can definitely get a good feeling on it. But um, it's a nice-looking shoe. Like I said the colors are from the um, the flag of Brazil. You've got this uh, citron kind of color. Well, it's not citron, it's more of just a green, not citron. Uh, green hip here on the top, green eyelet. You've got like a gold or, or tangerine um, eyelet there. 
all black. He's got a cream midsole, gum bottom. And the gum bottom just stays true all the way also on the bottom there. The print, the embossed print, this nice black leather. This is about um, names of idols are embossed on here. It's kind of hard to read, but again, it's also in, in Portuguese, so you're not really going to be able to read it. It's got like a glazed lace, a wax lace. Um, inside the shoe, you can see it says the Iposavel, and it's got Brazil 2011 with that green inside there also. Um, the people who um, designed it, actually it was three MCs. There was uh, Emicida, Emicida uh, Pixote, and Xara were three MCs that helped design it with an uh, artist named Toddy. All four of them kind of came together and put the shoe together. Um, looks nice. Like I said, it's a good, it's definitely a good look for, for Nike to stay in touch with uh, what's going on in the world, what's going on with different cultures. Uh, it looks cool. Uh, is there anything else? Like I said, I told you it's going to be very limited distribution with these. I told you Miami, a couple stores here in New York. Um, and that's about it. I'm going to show you a couple of hats that go with all this. Let me put this back up. That's, these were 135 on if I mention that again. I it. Oh, uh, they also come with uh, that green lace. Um, with that. Let's put this up here. We just have a couple of hats to go with it. With the shoes. This was my best match for that one right there. I don't want to cover the whole shoe, but you get an idea what that is. And I'm only picking out a couple colors of, because uh, I didn't have a hat that picked up every one of the colors, but these kind of went uh, the best with them. And that's not going to really stay, but there you go. No, it's not going to work. I'll take, take it down there. We'll go like this with it this time. And this is, I thought was a pretty cool match. I didn't think I was going to have something for this shoe, but actually my camera person picked this out and I thought it was a pretty good look. It's hanging up there. But pick up that, I thought that brown picks up that gum bottom really well. Um, oh, there's nothing staying today, but I usually get up here pretty fast. All right. Those are the three looks. They're nice. Um, all quick strikes. They're all really limited, especially that um, that Air Force Premium up top. There's only like 12 pair of those. Um, and they're all quick strikes. That's it. Uh, probably my next video is going to be, um, I'm still waiting for that uh, six rings to come in. I should be in any week. But uh, we thought we'd pop these in here. These are three quick strikes. I always tell you we'll get some in every once in a while, and these are the three. And that's it. Everybody stay up. Speak your out.